Hi Pisces, this is going to be your art channeled message and tar tarot reading. I channel messages through art, creativity, really anything, because I feel like everything represents creativity. The world is creative, we need creativity, that's what we lack now more than anything. So I really hope you enjoy this new spin I'm trying to do on content, because I really enjoy doing these messages doing these messages for people <laughs> what i started drawing for you pisces was a dna strand or dna strands then i got it's in your dna i'm seeing this literally like something runs in the family you inherited talents hobbies good traits but i'm also getting you're a natural it comes naturally to you it's in your dna you were meant to do this ever since you were born. You know how we all have our own unique DNA, unique purpose. That's what this is. Ever since you set foot on this earth, that's what you were this is what you were meant to do. I get a sense that people don't really have an explanation as to why you're so good at something. It's like have you ever looked at someone in awe of who they are? Like how do you do that? Where did you learn that? Where does it come from? must be in their DNA, must run in the family or something. That's all I can think of because it's like, where? How does their brain even, you know? Not in a bad way, but in a good way. So Pisces, I think there's this curiosity about you that leaves people wondering how. I just heard spontaneous and it's the perfect word for this energy. It's like it came out of thin air. Who are you? <laughs> how do you do it? Okay, I'm gonna, I might pull one of these too, but I don't know, we'll see. Chop wood. With the broomstick there, I'm thinking like, how do you put that together? You know how people like clean, clean it up, make it look nice? Like, how do you make that look nice? I'm also getting something with the way you design your house. So like, how do you make your house look so clean? Where did that come from? Or maybe this isn't like you at all. Also getting, this is really weird, but like crafting with wood. You make things out of wood. You know how people make, um, it's a form of construction. What do they call that? Wood shop? Wood shop. You make things out of wood. I even saw that scene in Elf right now where he made, he took the wood from the piano and made a rocking horse. And she's like, oh my god, you really made that? Where did you get all the wood? And they're like, oh, nothing. I just whipped it up from this. It's like you're recycling. Oh, that fell out. Time to go. <laughs> it's like... Someone here gets uncomfortable when people ask them how they do something. It's like watch. It's like someone watching you while you're trying to work. It's like, do you mind? I'm getting really shy and uncomfortable. It's like, time to go. I don't like questions. It's like, you like being a mystery. And I feel like you don't even have an explanation. I feel like that's how you say it too. It's like, I guess it's just a DNA thing. I guess it's just, I just do it. I don't know how. I don't know why. I'm also getting with like time to go, time to go, time to create or time to time to clean. Someone here, I'm getting someone here's a maid. Time to clean. Time to work. Time to work on this. Okay. I was gonna get another card, but I'm probably not. Yep, time to move, time to go. I'm getting it, like, this is straight after like an uncomfortable question. And you're like, oh, I can't answer that, time to go. Two of Cups. And look at the middle there, right off the bat, looks like a DNA strand. It's in your DNA. 
And it's like you're finding, obviously we all have our unique DNA. Not everyone's DNA is exactly the same. That's what's so cool about this. But they can be similar to you. This is usually my soul tribe card. It's like you're finding people with the same DNA as you. I feel like that, that's what freaked you out a little bit. It's like, why are we the same person? <laughs> You're about to meet someone that almost shares the same DNA as you. And then for some of you, I'm seeing this literally. Like, you're about to meet someone that shares the DNA, same DNA as you. Like, discovering you have a lost sibling or that you're related to someone and you didn't know you were related. I'm even getting Ancestry.com. But somehow you share the same DNA as somebody. This could be metaphorically or literally. I also just heard this song by Little Mix called, and it goes, it's in his DNA, DNA. And he just takes my breath away. He just, someone takes your breath away. I mean, this is a woman here and a man depicted in the card, but it doesn't have to be, but it's like someone takes your breath away. It's almost like you're so in awe of how similar you two are, and that's usually what this card is kind of about. It's like you, it's like you guys share the same DNA. It's like they are you. And it, it's mind-blowing. It's like, get out. <laughs> Not like you want them away from you, but it's like, oh my god, I gotta go. Like a figuratively. And then bottom of the deck we have the Emperor. like you met your match you met the emperor and notice how he's he's in red and then he's red here as well someone's meeting because the emperor it can be a father figure someone's meeting their father for the first time this could have been a deadbeat situation this could have been you never knew him you were adopted and now you're meeting your real parents King of Pentacles. Yeah, this is definitely an authority figure of some sort. You're meeting your dad, and it's it's like, wow, we really are related because they act just like me. I'm also getting with the broom here. Someone's trying to clean up their act or clean fix a relationship. So it's like someone's father wants to make amends. I did not expect to get this from DNA. It's like I'm literally getting a DNA reference, like literal family from something I thought was just going to be about something you do. <sighs> ah, some, this is crazy. The world here too, to me, is ideas. It's wanting to expand those ideas, wanting to act on these ideas, but wanting to do it together. So there's something you two bond over. You're about to bond with someone I feel could be someone you've never met before, someone you didn't even know you were related to, and you're gonna bond over something that you are you're already into and it's like get out. You like that too? This really does run in the family. I'm just like I'm just like you. I feel like this is a father. But there is hesitancy. So something tells me this person wasn't always there for you. And now they're trying to fix it, like clean it up, smooth it over, smooth things over with you. But then there's that. Could have all started with a message. Someone's overwhelmed. Someone's very overwhelmed. I don't know why. Like someone's overwhelmed. And I was saying like, how do you do it? What are you doing? What are you up to? And then she's running away like she doesn't like the confrontation. I'm also getting like multiple realizations are coming to you at once. 
or things are being revealed to you and it's like wait was my whole life a lie who really am i <laughs> this became much deeper than i expected it to be and then on the bottom of this deck it says blessed it's like maybe you're blessed with genetics you know people say genetics blessed me so like you're very good looking you look like your father you look like this person and you also inherited a very lovely talent from them that you're soon going to be bonding with them over i feel like things kick start things move in the right direction it's like time to go time to have fun but also time to go like i'm uncomfortable you're very uncomfortable so there's so many people trying to talk to you so many people hitting you with these weird messages weird news it's like is there anything else i don't know i feel like that's exactly what this is it's like you're getting hit with multiple bombshells and you wish you had time to just process you, yeah, that's what this time to go is time to process process this because i'm shocked Time to get myself together. Time to clean myself up. <laughs> and I was getting clean your house. Something with the way you decorate. So it's like you're preparing to have company. <laughs> I just saw Patrick from that one episode when he's expecting his parents. He And he got his parents confused with someone else, which is funny. But he was preparing for them and he was losing his mind. Like sweeping the floor, sweeping the ceiling. That's literally you right now. It's like, oh my god, I gotta prepare. I'm not prepared for all of this. I'm not prepared for company. It's called to be a family reunion. Family you haven't seen in years, and it's like you have to keep your appearances up. You wanna make them proud, but it's stressing you out. Wow. Ooh, and for some of you, select group of you, this person is very hard to please. I feel like you're gonna disappoint them. This how do you do it, this DNA thing could also be like, I want you to be like me. You feel pressured to act like them, impress them, do something that this person does, but you're really not interested in that. You have a different dream, you have a different priority. Ooh. Oh, a lion. Oh, and I think there's another card. Yep. Let it shine. Be generous of spirits. The lion is all about courage. Having the courage. And then look, let it shine. It's like having the courage to let it shine. Having the courage to be who you are. Unapologetically. And the, the light is coming from her heart space. Her heart, she, she makes decisions by her heart, from within, from her DNA. That's how she operates. Or you. It doesn't have to be a girl. That's just how I'm talking right now from the point of view. You're trying to be generous. You're trying to impress um, people, make them happy, make them proud. But you also want to be yourself. You want to let it shine. You want to let your gifts shine. Or you are, you're actively letting your gifts shine. You're letting it be known. And it's leaving people wonder, it's like, how the hell does she do that? It must be DNA. She must have gotten it from her father. She's just like him. And you like that, but you also want to be known for who you are. But you're also generous. You're thankful for your family. But you want to be your own person. Okay. So like this person also gives you courage. Well, it's getting a bit of a toxic element here, but they give you courage. They, get, they make you feel powerful. It's like maybe two people that do the same things. They're, they're a teacher to you. They're helping you strengthen your abilities. And I also think the peacock here is rather intimidated by the lion. But does the lion have the light? Does the lion guide the way? No, the peacock guides the way, 
she follows the light herself. All she has to do is let it shine. <laughs> yeah, all she has to do is let it shine and the people come to her, but it's very overwhelming. So yeah, I wanna let it shine, I wanna be myself, but it's like, can everyone like back off? You're so overwhelmed by this. It's like, give me time to process. <laughs> this is really cute actually. Okay, I think that's actually the end of this channeled message. There is, you're rather, you're overwhelmed by like, the news you're getting, you want time to process things. I'm also getting a lot of tidying up, like kind of like spring cleaning, even though we're still kind of in winter, we are getting closer to spring. So it's like, you feel like you need to prepare. And for some of you, it's literally you're meeting your dad for the first time and it's crazy. But I think this is gonna go well. You're gonna be very generous of this person. They're very helpful to you. But also you want to walk, you want to go your own way. You want to shine your light, make the right choices for yourself, not anyone else. And I respect that 100%. I think things are going to start, I'm going to kickstart into the right direction. Okay, Pisces, that's the end of your reading. Please like, subscribe, support the channel in any way you can. I would really appreciate it. And speaking of appreciation, I think a lot of people appreciate you. It's just you're not used to this crowd. Okay, Pisces. Bye.